Right, oh guys, check this out. Got the, um, the rack in, and just about to shoot the um, the creamy white for the top half of the doors. And um, yeah, got got evicted the bus outside. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it's got the lights all set up here. And uh, yeah, we're just going to get all this shot out. Got my little fan going over here. Unfortunately, was the rack wasn't quite big enough to fit that door, so he's going to have to go there. Um, but anyway, yeah, all good. We'll um, get this show on the road. I'll put you guys on the tripod, and I actually might just do a little bit of um, GoPro footage from the head mount this time. Oh, the other thing, compressor. Everyone was asking me about that guy. Um, Peerless. Um, it's a 620 liters per minute so it's a big it's a big guy uh, obviously two motor um, and you know you need if you're going to be spraying at home I, I actually am going to be doing a bit of sandblasting and this thing just keeps up no problem at all so it's it's um I think it's a 200 liter tank or 150 liter tank I think yeah 150 liter tank um, but yeah the you know most important bit about that is the liters per minute and it's 620 so it's pretty good pretty good most of the time only one motor kicks in but when it really needs it it'll uh, the second motor will kick in automatically um but yeah great little great little spray unit uh anyway yeah we'll go and check you guys on the tripod and um we'll shoot this um this white <laughs>
Okay, so we'll just check out the um, the aftermath. <laughs> um, no, it's all good. I actually got one drip, and I'll show you where it is. That one came out perfect. That one came out perfect. That one came out perfect. This one here, check this out. I'll just run the camera along it. Oh, yes. Very nice. It's kind of got that, um, it's a real slight ripple to it, but um, no, you, know, I mean, you wouldn't even, you wouldn't even rub that back. It's going to be perfect. Yeah, this one here I've got to run. First one in a while, and it's actually just there. <laughs> and it doesn't matter because that's all getting sanded to paint, to be painted red. So the top half is actually perfect. It just goes to show, if you're a little bit, uh, and I know why I got it run there too, because I was a bit slow on the start of the pass right in this spot here. And that's why it just ran down here, just that little bit there, you can see it. There it is. You go back and forth, you can see it. Just do it right under the swage line. So that's perfect, I can sand that out, and not a problem. But everything else is Mickey Mouse. No issues at all. So pretty happy with that. Now the dilemma is I've got to get the bus back in and I've got to move all this. It's like, crap, I need a bigger shed. Uh, anyway, um, well, that'll be, um, let that dry overnight and I suppose I can start tackling the, um, the back sides of those ones there, which did, I'll just spray those in red. And then um, what I'll do is then is actually hang all the panels on the bus um, and spray all the red while it, they're actually mounted on the bus because then what happens is you're getting off the gun straight across all the panels and you're not getting any issues. Well, maybe, we'll see, we'll see. Maybe I will hang them on, hang them up here because it's the same, same idea, I suppose. I'll, I'll see, I'll work it out. Anyway, cheers for popping in. Uh, it's coming along good, sweet.